There are several ways of prototyping, and Arduino has made it easier. But is there a more effective way? Using a breadboard with jumper cables? This traditional way is useful, but sometimes the situation might become complicated. Another way is using Arduino with shields. But generally, you can't stack more than three shields due to pin overlaps. Even if you succeed in it, this is a useful way to make a tower, but not for prototyping. We offer a new and simple way, Tiny Lab. Tiny Lab is a tablet-sized prototyping lab. It's aesthetic and convenient, super easy to use. Open the cap, plug in the USB cable, then upload your sketch. That's all. Tiny Lab has an Arduino Leonardo at its heart. There are sockets for XB, Bluetooth, ESP8266, and RF24 modules. Also, it has LCD, micro SD reader, 7 segment display, real time clock, relay, potentiometer, external EEPROM, buzzer, rotary encoder, temperature sensor, demoter driver, photoresistor, buttons, LEDs. Oh. Tiny Lab is cross platform and it's perfect for learning the basis of programming a microcontroller by making applications with it. Tiny Lab is portable and ready to use. You can put it in your bag and take it with you wherever you go. Tiny Lab is entirely open source. You can find all stuff on our GitHub repo. Tiny Lab provides you fully integrated prototyping environment and reduces prototyping costs. It's the same price as when Arduino Shield. You can focus on your idea instead of wiring something. Tiny Lab, prototype easier than ever. Hi. I am the lead hardware designer of TinyLab. We design TinyLab based on common needs of community. After several prototypes and debug processes, TinyLab is ready to launch. Now, it's necessary to mass produce TinyLab to reach all community with acceptable price. We hope your support on Indiegogo. Let's make prototyping easier than ever together. TinyLab satisfies the need of prototyping substantially. But if you say that I still love my sheets, we arranged a place for them on TinyLab. <laughs>